Hi, it's Tony Mallet here. I'd like to welcome you to the second video entitled Energy as part of the series called Leaf Growth. And this is for your motivation and inspiration. And uh, behind me just down here, there is an old water mill that for centuries has been transforming water into energy. And that's the focus of today's video. So uh, come with me and I'll, I'll show you a bit more. Aristotle once said that the energy of mind is the essence of life. Now you're probably wondering where is all this leading to Tony? I mean water mills and water wheels and energy, what's it all about? Let me explain. So here we have this idea of water power being converted into energy which of course the mill would use to create uh, woven products and sell those and create abundance. So we have an energy transfer from water energy to a physical manifestation. Now you have seven billion 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 atoms worth of energy inside your marvelous mind and the great question is what are you doing with that energy? I mean that's more than the number of stars in the cosmos. What are we doing with that energy? The wheel transfers that energy into a physical manifestation. Your mind is exactly the same. Now this meadow that I'm stood in is just like your mind, like that huge water mill, wheel that spins round, just waiting to receive the energy and act upon it. It was Wayne Dyer that once said, if you change the way you look at things, the things you look at, they change. Now what we want to do is to open your mind, like this gate, to the possibilities and just see what happens. It's the great I am declaration. I am that I am. What are you filling your mind with? Are you filling it with positive thoughts or negative thoughts? Now you can tell what's uh, driven over this mud as it's baked in hard. You can tell there's a tractor track there going down this field. Your mind is exactly the same. Whatever you put into your mind is consolidated just like this mud. Stephen Richards once said, a thought is a cosmic order just waiting to happen. So let's summarise where we've got to so far. You already have everything that you need. It's locked up inside. It just requires you to apply that marvellous mind. Operating from a point of not enoughness, in other words, there's never enough, is never going to allow you to achieve your dreams or at least aspire to those goals that you have. Instead, you need to replace this with a I am statement. I am that, I am. That's very, very powerful. Use that on a daily basis and keep thinking about that uh, water mill and how that transferred that water energy into something physical. The greatest obstacle you ever have will be the ne negative chatter that takes place in your mind. Instead you need to transfer that to positive chatter. Transfer this, form this thought into something positive. If you want to transform negative chatter, always ask yourself when a thought bubbles up, is this thought serving me? That is so powerful and a good friend of mine uses that all the time. Be it, in other words, be who you wish to be now. Act as if very very powerful. Choose to serve. This is the magical ingredient. If you choose to serve then you're always going to succeed. One.